X Factor family, welcome back to the channel. Alright, what's going on family? I have already started the day, got the day moving. I had breakfast, my normal breakfast. I had some strawberries, I had uh, a packet of banana nut oatmeal, and I had some almonds. And I actually ended up putting the almonds inside the oatmeal, which was really, really good. But uh, that was breakfast, man. We went to lunch. So that that breakfast came, and then like an hour later, we went to lunch. Fine, because I was pretty hungry anyways. Uh, but we went to the famous In-N-Out. We really don't, where I'm at in Texas, we don't have an In-N-Out close. The closest one is Fort Worth, which is two hours away. So uh, I never go to In-N-Out. So we went to In-N-Out today to cut back. Instead of getting fries, I just got the burger. So I got a double-double, which I tracked in my fitness pal, of course. And it totaled up to about 37 protein, 39 carbs, and 41 grams of fat. I think that's an accurate number. I am not sure. I'm, I'm no uh, perfectionist. I don't really know if that's that accurate, but it looks about right. That's a lot of fat, uh, moderate amount of carbs based off of the bread, and a decent amount of protein based off of the two patties. Uh, and the bread as well. So I uh, definitely got that in. So so basically I wanted to say, uh, yeah, you can eat out, you can eat burgers. You just gotta limit it. Don't load up on fries. The fries have a lot of fat as well. And so you will end up probably maxing out your fats if you were to have a burger and fries. So cut back, one of the guys I was with, he ended up just getting the burger with uh, lettuce. So like a lettuce wrap. Basically a burger without the bun. That's a good way to do it as well. But me, I can afford some carbs. Plus it was my pretty much second meal of the day. I definitely need some carbs in, so I went ahead and splurged. Um, that was it for lunch. Then we went to the outlets. Uh, it, was, it was cool, you know, just check out the scenery. Uh, North, North Las Vegas, the premium outlets. I didn't get anything large. What I did get was um, a sunglass kit. So basically, uh, my sunglasses are missing a screw, so I asked the guy at the sunglass place how hard would it be for me to get a screw. He said, oh, that's easy. Here goes a screw right here. So he gave me two screws, and then he persuaded me to get the screwdriver and the lens uh, spray, which I went ahead and got because he was very generous, so I went ahead and got that. So I got a nice little, little sunglass kit. Then I got a bib for my little shorty. Uh, my little boo, I got her little bib. I got my wife a uh, shot glass. I usually get a shot glass every state I go to so I can load up. I wanna have 50 shot glasses, one from each state. So I did get one from here in Las Vegas, Nevada. And um, got a magnet as well. So anyways, enough about that. That's pretty much the afternoon, that's what happened. Um, now I'm about to call my wife, talk to her for a little bit. It is right now. Uh, 251. Uh, I decided that I'm not going to go out to dinner with the guys tonight. I'm going to eat in the room, you know, since that burger was very macro destroying, you want to call it. I'm going to go ahead and eat in the room, keep it light, you know, some chicken, some rice. Um, so, therefore, I have enough time to actually get a decent long workout in. So, what I'm planning on doing is getting a little extra credit in the gym, man. I'm going to be in the gym. I'll probably add uh, a set to every rep. That didn't make sense. I'll probably add a set to every exercise. Um, might even add some more reps, never know. Um, but I'm also gonna add probably two exercises, an another super set. And I'm already thinking it's a leg day. Good thing it's a leg day. I'm thinking about adding um, some goblet squats and maybe some seated hamstring curls. But we'll see how it goes, but it's a leg day. Because it's later in the afternoon, I might be able to get some footage for you guys. So if I can, I'm gonna get what I can. I might even sit in the sauna. I'm definitely gonna get my cardio in. Like I said, extra credit. So I'm gonna get a full amount of cardio in, maybe like 45 minutes or something like that. The best way, the best way to stay lean and eat out is to do cardio. So make sure you get your cardio in. Don't neglect your cardio. So I'm gonna get my cardio in and probably sit in the sauna for a little bit. Just relaxing because I don't have plans tonight. The only thing I gotta do tonight is work. So I have to go back to the work uh, about 11.30 tonight probably. And uh, that's that. So let me go ahead and call my wife, change my clothes, and I'll check back with you guys when it's gym time. Alright, 
Ready for the gym? Let's get it. All right, X Factor family, this is how I'm ending off my eating for the night. It is now 8:22. I'm gonna finish off my macros, and I'm gonna do it, you know, fairly right. I'm gonna finish it off with a packet of banana nut protein oatmeal. So 10 grams of oatmeal, 10 grams of protein in there. And then I'm gonna, I have two packets of this lemon pepper tuna. So if you don't like regular tuna, go ahead and get the flavored tuna. This is pretty good. Uh, I've had lemon pepper tuna before, so I'm pretty sure it tastes all the same. So I got two packets of that. That's giving me about 28 grams of protein. And then I'm gonna go ahead and finish off with some sweet chili uh, rice crisps. These are the chips I was talking about at the time when I called them pop chips, but they actually called popped rice crisps. So sweet chili, I'm just gonna have one serving. Uh, one serving actually has five grams of fat, uh, 21 carb, and two protein. Uh, and it's actually 18 of the rice crisps or one serving. And of course, my water, as always. Um, yes, everything's my, my fitness pal. Check the macros, all my meals, starting from breakfast, going to in and out post-workout. Got the lemon pepper with the rice crisps, and then we got our oatmeal. So that brings us to 2,500 calories. Uh, let's see. Final 167 protein, 304 carb, 79 fats. Fiber, pretty good, pretty decent. So yeah, man, that's gonna conclude this vlog, man. Day five complete. I forgot one thing. <laughs> one thing I forgot. I forgot to talk to you guys about my post-workout meal. So for my post-workout meal, I had three chicken breast fillets, of course the Tysons that you've seen before, and I had two cups of jasmine rice, which was real good, man. And then uh, that was pretty much post-workout. That's all I had for my post-workout meal. It was real good, too. But yeah, that's gonna include this vlog, man. Gotta go into work in a few hours, so I wanna finish off my eating now. Uh, at the gym, I did do what I said I was gonna do, and I went ahead and got some extra sets. Um, I actually doing some extra exercises and I did 30 minutes of cardio. I did 15 on the Stairmaster and 15 on the elliptical. I wanted to sit in the sauna, but the sauna was actually out of order. Lucky me. But it was all good, so I uh, definitely got my cardio in today. Um, and uh, I want to finish off my eating now early, about 8, 8.30. I want to be done eating. I don't want to eat anymore. I want to let all the food digest and I can wake up refreshed in the morning. So tonight's, of course, going to be a long night, as always. Uh, but I'm good to go. So thank you guys for watching this video. If you liked it, go ahead and click that like button down below. Subscribe to the channel. And look forward to day six. Catch you guys in the next video. Thank you for watching. So, and my neighbors look at me like how he purchased that himself, cause I'm a seven figure, self-made nigga.